Hey family, it's the Mobile Home Diva and in today's video, I am going to be touring the Magnolia. This is the Magnolia, it's by Destiny Homes. Okay, love, love, love the trim work. It doesn't have like the, um, what do you call them? The, uh, oh, I'm looking at one on this, on the, what is it that goes on either side of the window? I have it on the screen, but it has the wood trim around it. Love it, love it, love it, love it. Love it, let's go see what the back looks like. I hate when I can't think of what I'm trying to say. This is the back of the house. All right, back of the house. I actually haven't walked in this one first, so I'm gonna see it when you see it. This is my next to the last house. I'm hot and tired. <laughs> I've toured all of those homes. <sighs> all right, the Magnolia by Destiny. It's a three bedroom, two bath. This is 32 by 64. So this is a nice size home. Any other specifications that I have will be in the description box. So this is what you see, really nice. This is what you see when you walk into the home, you guys, really nice. I'm gonna put my stuff down. That's the front door. You've got dark floors in here. You've got light color beams, which is really pretty. Ceiling fan in here, large, two large windows. Great space for your TV and this entertainment section. You've got storage and an electric fireplace under the bottom. Really nice. Really nice. This house is huge. Really pretty. So all of this is living room. And then this area is your dining room. Now what I like about the dining room space is in addition to the window that helps to separate the space, but you also have this like china cabinet hutch situation. You can put dishes up there. You can put whatever you want up there, but I just like that you have the space. You can make the cabinet space like a beverage station. You can do whatever you want, okay? Really nice use of space. Very nice. So all of this is your dining room, okay? And then your kitchen is over here. You've got stainless steel appliances, large butcher block island. You could probably put three or four people at that island, depending on how your stools are made. Lots of window space. You've got these two windows here. You've got those three large windows over there. Look at all this counter space. There's a drawer for every cabinet. Love it. If you know me, you know I love soft clothes. Nope, I don't think so. Nope, not soft clothes. If I was interested in this home, if I was purchasing, I would definitely upgrade to soft clothes. Really nice. Love this black sink. This is a nice industrial black sink. First time I've seen that sink in that color. So really nice, really lovely. You got a bunch of outlets for your appliances. Lots of space. Love it, love it, love it, love it. Love it. While we're here, 
Uh, we're going to check out the uh, laundry room. There's your pendant lighting. I just love it. I love the space. I'm standing at the sink and I can see clear to the front door. Like this is just a huge space, you guys. I could see furniture in here. I could see it all decorated. I could see it looking like home. Like this home is beautiful. Love it. Love all the windows down this whole row. Like in the mornings when you come in and open the blinds, the light that pours in, beautiful. Really nice. So your laundry room is over here. You've got a nice, deep, wide sink. Your back door is right there. You've got space for your washer and dryer over there behind this door. Really nice. And then you've got a powder room. So your toilet is on this side. You've got a transom window up here and your sink is over here. Really nice. Again, I didn't come in and tour this home before I turned on the camera. So I am seeing all of this for the first time with you and I'm, I'm super impressed. Really lovely. So back through the kitchen. It even feels cool in here. Like this home is well insulated. As you can see, it's finished drywall, but it's these homes are well insulated. It's the same with my home, okay? And I don't have finished drywall. We have the seams, but my home is so well insulated. It's cool in the summer and it holds heat in the winter and I love it. So through the living room, around this corner, the first door on the left is the bathroom. You've got a transom window in this bathroom as well. All right, and you, there's your sink. Lots of cabinet space. So this is the additional bedroom, bathroom, sorry, the guest bath or the kids bath or whatever you want to call it. Here's bedroom number one. This is a three bedroom, two bath. Nice size bedroom. You've got a walk-in closet over there. Really nice. Across from the bathroom is bath bedroom number two. Lovely. And you've got another walk-in closet over here. Super duper nice. Really nice. Awesome. I love this house. I love it. All right, so just to get your bearings again, when you come around the corner from this, I'm in the living room. So you come around this corner, you've got a bathroom and two bedrooms, okay? So that's what that looks like. Okay, in the living room, see? See where we are? So to the right of this entertainment center is the additional bedrooms. And then to the left of this entertainment center is the master. Really nice. So all of that is master. That's the door to the living room. This is the door to the master bathroom. You got a barn door here. If you don't like it, you can certainly get a regular door. You've got a huge soaker tub to the left. You've got two windows that open and a nice storage area over the tub. There are your double sinks. The mirrors, there are mirrors. They're just not up. These are the mirrors that go in the master bath. So you have those round mirrors that go over each sink. Lots of space here, lots of cabinet and drawer space. In the master closet, you've got your toilet room over here. You've got this really nice shower. I love these doors. Love the tile, and I love the way the the uh, 
bench is positioned. So it makes it a long bench instead of a short bench coming this way. Super nice. Got your shower head right there. Always nice to have the rain shower. Shower head, really nice. And then at the end of the hall is your master closet. So all of this is master closet with additional storage in the middle to separate his and her. I'm not gonna shed the door cause there's no light in here and it'll get dark. I want you to be able to get an idea. So really nice. That's your master closet. Really lovely. This is nice. Built-in towel racks. Really, really lovely. Again, this is the Magnolia by Destiny Homes. The Magnolia price includes setup and delivery within 50 miles. Of course, if, it, if it's delivered over 50 miles, there's an overage charge. It also includes any additional trim. The exterior steps. Now, if you want decks, that you have to pay for those. But if you'll take the steps, it comes with steps to, to both doors. The white vinyl skirting, if you want brickwork on the bottom, you have to pay additional for that. It also comes with heating and air and the appliances that are in here. Lot model price is 142000 plus tax. Really lovely. Really lovely. All right, you guys, I hope you enjoyed this tour. This is the Magnolia by Destiny. I'm out, Destiny Homes. I'm out here at Custom Homes of Cordell. All the information to their lot will be in the description box. If I have any pricing or specification, all of that is in the description box. Well, I do have pricing. If I have any specifications or any additional information, it'll be in the description box. If not, you'll have to call the dealer, you guys. I tour these homes because I like touring them, all right? Not because I work for the company, because I don't. Hope you enjoyed this tour. I'll see you in the next one.